Hey y'all, welcome back to my home or welcome if it's your first time here. My name is Kelly Ann and today we are up super early, at least for me, to get some cleaning done. My house was a mess. My husband had been out of town and I wanted to make sure that our house was nice and clean when he got home. But first I'm gonna make myself a coffee and I'm just gonna add some of this yummy cookie dough creamer. And then you just wait, of course this coffee is gonna end up overflowing on me and creating an even bigger mess in my kitchen. So first I'm gonna take care of that. And then we are gonna get to cleaning up the living room. My son Drew has been absolutely obsessed with books lately. He loves to just play with the books. He doesn't really let me read to him. I'll try to read to him, but then he just wants to rip the book out of my hand and point at the pretty pictures. But right now he's in that crazy destructive toddler phase. So he just turns this house upside down every day. And the night before I didn't clean it up because I was, I was so tired from just taking care of him and my husband being gone. So that is why I am up so early this morning. You'll see it later in this video, but I finally got some things to be able to toddler proof these cabinets because as you can tell, Drew loves to rummage through them and pull things out. But pretty soon, I, I can't say soon, but hopefully in the next month or two, I will be doing an organizing video where I actually go through and I clean everything that's in these cabinets since Drew has drug it out I want to make sure everything's clean and then organize it and put it back in there so whenever I'm cooking I can just grab Tupperware or whatever and not have to worry about cleaning it before I put food in it. I could not get this gingerbread man to stand back up on this little display thing. It kept falling over. But if y'all have not seen my decorating videos for Christmas yet and y'all enjoy decorating for Christmas, please go ahead and check out those videos on my channel once you're done watching this video. Of course, my coffee has already gotten cold, so I'm gonna heat it up real quick. I feel like my coffee does not stay hot long because I put so much creamer and milk into it that an espresso machine makes coffee so strong. So I do add probably, I don't know, an eighth of a cup of milk and then a couple tablespoons of creamer because I don't wanna put too much creamer because that's where most of the calories are and I don't want a lot of sugar or anything in the morning. But now we are just wiping off these kitchen counters. Some people 
The other day I took this vacuum cleaner apart to clean it really well and I figured out that you can make this basically a kid's vacuum. I know Drew is always trying to help me vacuum and it sort of gets in the way. So I'm going to try making it just a shorter version. You take out like the center piece that makes the handle so long and I think Drew will be able to push it around and he's going to think it's fun but really he's going to be actually helping me clean. Yay, we are finally toddler proofing. First, I put it on wrong. I don't know what I was thinking, but I've been pretty happy with the way that these things work. I'm just having to get used to having to take them off before I open them up. So they do get in the way a little bit, but it's nothing compared to having Drew take everything out of those cabinets and throwing it on the floor. It helps me unwind. Now we're gonna wake up Drew. I knew his room was a mess, so I went ahead and brought his bottle up here so he could drink it while I cleaned his room real quick. But lately we have been playing in his nursery. We typically used to not do that, but now it's just nice to keep the mess into one place because when we're downstairs, he can bring the mess throughout the whole entire first floor. and carry I really, really, really need to go through all of Drew's clothes soon. As you saw, his dresser is just busting out the seams. So I really need to go in and just get rid of some clothes. And I also need to put some of his clothes in the attic. I think I'm gonna get some more vacuum bags and just vacuum seal the ones that I want to keep as keepsakes because I figure if they're vacuum sealed, the bugs probably can't get into them, like moths or whatever, because I know that's an issue when storing clothes. So I don't know, I will have to look into that. So that is about it for today's video. I know it was short, but I hope you got plenty of early morning cleaning motivation to get it all done today. But I hope you have a fantastic day. See you next time.